like you look at Mo Salah, for example, right, and you think, look, you see him, he's one of the greatest players to come into the Premier League. My camera died, by the way, so I'm just saying that again. But you look at him and you think, okay, you know, he's not having his best season, but Bobby Firmino's come on and he's sort of taking that mantle and scoring goals. You know, it's just like, it's just what I'm saying. Like, when you have options, it just, it, it, when someone's having a bad game or whatever, kind of going on a bit of a bad run, you have someone there to sort of support them and also, like, you know, encourage them. You know what I'm saying? And it's just like, we don't have that, bro. And it's just like, and the reason why I'm angry and I'm not too fan of Tesla Pamela, I'm not worried, is because we knew this coming into the season. Like, time and time again, Arsenal knew this. Like, not only on the Arteta, on the Emery and Rengar, like, we just go into seasons unprepared. Like, we're not well prepared to go for a whole title challenge, title charge the whole season. But we're just not. You're, you are a foolish person if you genuinely think that with this squad alone, Arsenal can do win the league without having any additions. Uh, look, this January, we have to buy those two players. You know, in, I mean, those two positions, players in those positions, in a, whether it's a winger, in a, uh, or, or just a forward attacker, or, and, 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 and a midfielder. Like, we need, go and get Tillemans, bro. Just go and get him, bro. Everybody was say, 